I use a ton of pedals. I assume a lot of other people use a ton of pedals too. And like all other options I've seen for like loop switchers or ABY boxes or volume pedals, they're always big or they require programming or a lot of thought and you're kind of limited by space. And I feel like this takes the best aspects of all of those things and condenses them into one small, easy to use pedal. So the Swiss Things is an ABY box, a booster, two effects loops, a buffer, has jacks for tuner out, and expression control for volume. So the idea for the Swiss Things came about from a conversation I had with a friend of mine who used two big pedal boards. And on those boards he had like input booster and buffers and an output booster. And uh, he used two amps and he had an ABY box. And that kind of got me thinking about my own issues with my pedal board which I fluctuate, like this is probably the smallest pedal board I've had in a long time. I usually have one that's like twice the size with twice as many pedals on them, but I don't use them all, all the time. And what I was noticing is that I had a lot of tone suck from my pedal board. Um, if I plugged the guitar straight into the amp, it was significantly brighter and louder. And then that idea kind of just exploded and grew into what became the Swiss Lings. The whole pedal was designed pretty much specifically for how I set up my pedal board. So, you know, I envisioned this thing that would sit in the upper right hand corner that would be the brain of the pedal board. So that's why I have the input on the right side and the outputs at the top. So it's pretty specific to how I set up my pedal board. But I think it's useful to everybody in that position. One of my favorite features is just like being able to put the flexi switching on anything and you know being able to have like a phaser and a reverb and a delay pedal on all at the same time and then you could just hold it down for as long as you want it on and lit it off. I also like being able to take everything out of the chain at once or being able to mute the signal because I only use one amp so if you use the AB you could use the B as a mute switch. Just troubleshooting, like how am I gonna put, you know, where am I gonna put these buffers? Where am I gonna place the volume expression in the, in the path? And, you know, how to combine a booster and two effects loops and these buffers and an ABY box and all of this into something that was a manageable size and fit on a pedal board. It was a fun problem to solve. <laughs>